This is your Ready Sports Update. I'm Holly Carter. Sports across campus are in full swing this semester. The Ready football team wrapped up a great weekend when they traveled to West Georgia. They faced the Bulldogs and were able to bring home a victory. With an all but absent running game all season, Henderson came alive on Saturday. Running back Jarvis Smith rushed for just under 200 yards. Offensively, the Reddies pounded out 447 yards. Redshirt freshman quarterback Kevin Rogers completed 18 of 24 passes for 193 yards. The Reddy defense made a show as well. They accounted for eight tackles for a loss and two sacks. Senior linebacker Aaron Plant added six tackles. Senior Antonio Leak also had an impressive day for the Reddies with three tackles for a loss, a quarterback hurry, and a blocked punt. The Reddies play at home again on October 22nd for homecoming. They face East Central University. Because of the performance by running back Jarvis Smith, he has just been named the Great American Conference Offensive Player of the Week. Smith ran for 183 yards on 19 carries, averaging just over 9 yards per carry. He also added three touchdowns for the Reddies. His totals make him the fifth highest rusher in a single game in Henderson history. Smith is also the first rusher for the Reddies this season to break the 100-yard mark. Also making news in the sports world on campus is the Lady Ready volleyball team, but unfortunately it's not good news. The ladies have not won a game since September 20th and are now 4-14 on the season. The team is young with only one returner from last year, but head coach Wanda Thigpen expects more from her team. Last week, following the loss to Crosstown rival OBU, Thigpen stated that her girls gave up, but then blamed herself, saying she needs to work the girls harder. The ladies are looking to add to the win column soon, hopefully when they play at home again on October 13th. They will host Arkansas Tech, and tip-off is scheduled for 7 p.m. We've got golf and cross-country news right after the break. Welcome back to your Ready Sports Update. The Ready and Lady Ready golf team opened up their season under new direction and it seems to be paying off. The Reddies finished as runners-up to Arkansas Tech in the Bison Fall Classic. Sam Lavelle led the men, tying for first place six under par. Matt Jennings tied for fifth place with the team best nine birdies. Jared Black and Reggie English tied for eighth, both finishing even par. The Lady Ready golf team also fared well at the tournament finishing third. The top Lady Ready finisher was Taylor Brown at 7th place. Brown shot the best rounds of her Henderson career and collected her first top 10 finish collegiately. Jessica Parks finished in 10th place for the Lady Reddies while Julie Robinson finished 14th. Both the Reddies and Lady Ready golf teams play again on October 10th and 11th in Destin, Florida. And while the golfers head to Florida, the Lady Ready cross country team is just returning. The Lady Ready Cross Country team competed in the Gulf Coast Stampede in Pensacola. The ladies finished 12th in the event, which included teams from all NCAA divisions. Top Lady Ready finisher was Charlotte Wetzler, finishing 41st with a time of 20 minutes 34 seconds. In 63rd place, Lady Ready Jace Tatum crossed the finish line in 22 minutes even. The ladies round out their season on October 22nd in Searcy, Arkansas at the GAC Championships. That's all the Ready Sports update we have for you today. Be sure to tune in next week to HTV News for the latest news on Henderson State University. I'm Holly Carter.